Hey, how are you? It's me, your friend Matthew. A little under a year ago, I made a video called I Confused People on Facebook Marketplace, where I went onto Facebook Marketplace and tried my best to confuse people by sending them messages and uh, seeing if they were con confused. <laughs> I confused myself with that one. <laughs> Shut up. I'm not gonna be a dick, I just see what they're selling, and then I send them a message in hopes that they'll reply and be like, what? Wait a second. <laughs> That's not what I was expecting from when I put this up on the marketplace. I was expecting a genuine inquiry about this item I'm trying to sell or the service. Sex? No. All right, we've got a mug with uh, a cock on it. <laughs> Hi, is this available? Nope, more like. <laughs> no way. Whose is this? Hopefully that'll confuse them. Starting off on free stuff, we've got a free piano. Okay, uh, Charlene selling this. Charlene looks lovely. <laughs> so lovely. I haven't seen that thing in ages. Am I looking for a certain response? The answer is yes. I'm looking for someone to reply with a question mark in their answer, right? Because then we fully confuse them. If they say like what or qu question mark, then we've we've done our job. That's all we want, right? So, yeah. Squirrel picnic table. That's actually kind of dope. How old is the squirrel you got this from? One of those questions you just have to ask. Bird and wildlife accessories. Bird feeder. Hey, would this feed my dad? <laughs> I don't know what the goal is here. There's not really a goal to any of this. Am I looking for a certain response? The answer is yes. We got a response from Charlene. Not sure what you mean. We did it. We've done it already. <laughs> yeah, you too. <laughs> what an idiot. Rare snake plant copper tone. Mmm. Hey! <laughs> what are there? Snakes in this plant? <laughs> snake plant? That's, abs that's absurd. Let's see if people are selling animals. Mmm, dog collar and harness set. What's the dog's name that comes with it? <laughs> Not even looking at you anymore, I'm just looking here. Not a good practice. I should be looking at you more often. You're the real treasure here. I am's cat food. How's it taste? Wet? Chunky? Both? <laughs> yeah. LED collars, dog, cat? Holy Moses, that dog is pimping. He must wreck put. Okay, no, can't say that. Dog clothes? Oh, that's the cutest shit I've ever did. I ever did see. Okay, maybe we don't need 80 pictures. Would this fit my. What's a funny thing? What's a thing? What, what would confuse Cheryl? Would this fit my, my nan? She's only like 5'1. <laughs> well, geez. Nobody. Nobody told me you had a dog. Since when? Ha! What's the little fella's name? That's not confusing. That's just me genuinely asking what the dog's name is. Get on track, Matt. Right, let's go somewhere else. Hey, I'm a guy with an absolute, with an absolute dump and childbearing hips. But I'm also pretty tall and a little bashful. Would these fit? I actually kind of need a shirt, a pair of shorts like that. I think I'd look really good. I'd have to, I have to hide my bulge. I just tuck it between my pants. Legs. I, I'm just kidding, I don't have a bulge. Hey, whoa, how are you? It's me from the next day. I wanna give a quick shout out to today's sponsor, Native. It's always weird to do an ad read like this because it kind of seems disingenuous where of course you know the brand sends me notes to go by, but I wanna be serious with this one. Native is an aluminum, paraben, and sulfate-free deodorant. They have body washes and plenty of other things too, but I've only used their deodorant and it's great. But not just because it smells good. They sent me charcoal, coconut and vanilla, and lavender and rose. So far I've only used charcoal. It smells very, it's the manliest of the three in my opinion. I'm gonna use the coconut and vanilla next. It smells like my dad's body butter. <laughs> It really does. It's it's really good though. Yes. <laughs> but what I like most about it is that I've been using a like dollar store deodorant for most of my life, just the cheapest I could find. It always leaves me with itchy pits and just it's just sticky and gross and horrible. Native is not that. They care about what they're making. It's not sticky. It dries quickly and it's very long lasting. And on top of that, they're a vegan brand that's cruelty free and they use simple ingredients you can understand, like coconut oil and shea butter. They ship their products to all of these countries and they ship free to the U.S. Three of these bad boys are usually thirty six dollars, but if you use my link in the description and code. 
Colbo, you can save 33% and get them for just $24. Thank you to Native for sponsoring this video and supporting the channel. And of course to you as well, let me know what you think if you get some Native. I encourage you to do so because of course supporting Native is supporting me as well. So thank you in advance. All right, back to me from yesterday. You'll see me again shortly. Shiny American Apparel, American Apparel. Is everything here American Apparel? Disco pants it's being sold by Casey. Hey Casey. I'm a size 33 waist, but if I suck in, I can lose a few inches. You think that'll be all right? Blacksmith apparel clothing. What in God's cock? <laughs> Wouldn't mind seeing this on my dad. He looks good. You can't... We limit how often you can post, comment, or do other things at a given amount of time to help protect the community from spam. Oh, shut up. So I can't do any more? I can't send any more messages on Facebook Messenger, but that's the whole point of the video. Craigslist, for sure. Now we're talking. Cowboy boots, women's size 7, this is right up my ass. Now I've got just the strangest little tit toes. But I am a man. A man with big feet. Just with small little strange tit toes. Do you think these boots will fit? Please respond and tell me so. I don't want to buy any of them non-fitting boots. My mom once bought a pair that didn't fit. Boom! Three days later, divorce. Okay, welcome back. It's the next day. Let's hop back in and see who uh, replied to us. <laughs> Let's see if we successfully confuse some folk. <laughs> okay, Marcel has replied to our message about the squirrel picnic table. I said, how old is the squirrel you got this from? And Marcel said, brand new. He definitely thought that I was talking about how old is the table itself and not how old is the squirrel. But that's not what I was talking about. I was talking about the squirrel. <laughs> Okay, Casey replied to, Casey was the one with the disco pants. So let's see what Casey has to say. I said, hey Casey, I'm a size 33 waist, but if I suck in, I can lose a few inches. You think that'll be all right? No idea, it's an extra small. Please look up American Apparel size charts. I don't know. She's pissed. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be Casey, ready? Hey, Casey, I'm a size 33 waist, but if I suck in, I can lose a few inches. You think that'll be all right? No idea, it's an extra small. Pulls look up American Apparel size charts. Ibk. Allie replied to LED collars dog cat. I said, holy Moses, that dog is pimping. And he said, yes. <laughs> Not confused, just agrees. Glad to hear. Hope he lives forever. Okay. Not nice. Edward replied to rare snake plant. I said, hey, <laughs> what are there, snakes in this plant? And he said, it is a snake plant. He wasn't confused at all. He just corrected me and said, no, you fool. It's a snake plant. And I knew that. I don't know what a snake plant is, but now I do. What is a snake plant? Mother-in-law's tongue. <laughs> Taryn. I messaged Taryn about the assorted handmade glassware. The glasses that had the dicks on it. <laughs> Whose is this? And she said, what's going on here? And <laughs> did it! Yes! That's a success. She's so confused, dude. <laughs> Whose is this? You have no idea. What an idiot. LOL. My friend hacked my account. Remember that? You'd go over to your friend's house and they were still logged into Facebook on their computer and then while they were taking a shit or something, you'd just say, HACKED! New status. HACKED! Leave your computer open without a password, idiot? You're gonna get hacked. Alright, let's see what Craigslist has. Did I get any messages back? Thank you very much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, uh, you know, leave it a thumbs up. It's free and it helps the channel a lot because when you do that, the algorithm says, wow, a lot of people like that. So I'll show it to more folks and then more folks see it and then more folks come on over here and that hopefully when they hear this message, I can then say to them, press the subscribe button because it's free and it helps the channel. So <laughs> helps us all, doesn't it? Not you, but me. And you're nice, you're a nice guy. Thank you again to Native for sponsoring this video and thank you for uh, just being yourself. What? I don't know. All right, take care. Comb your hair. <laughs> I'll see you soon. <laughs>